people to find their passion and purpose in life and achieve that. Because if you do what you love, um, you know, a lot of us do what we love. Some of us don't. But if you do what you love, you can be way more productive and right. happier. Right. And in the end of the day, isn't that our goal? bitchy, it's okay to be cranky, it's okay for anchor, anger to fuel you, it's okay to be aggressive, and even if your male counterparts tell you otherwise or say, wow, that's unseemly, I think it's just okay. We don't have to be um, pure and perfect in order to be successful. A buddy of mine, uh, she's the founder of Austin Women Magazine, and she has this, this catchphrase that's fabulous. She goes, the female role models, if you can't see it, you can't be it. Right. So if I'm a 24-year-old young lady just graduating and I don't see anyone else who looks like me, then, you know, what do I do? So right. that's why I love this event. No, yeah, no, no, no I think it is really important that, um, you know, there's all those cliches around the fact that, you know, you've got to go through the window sometimes or, you know, opportunities are, are masked and they, they really are. And so just saying yes to everything and really being open to trying new things and learning new experiences will give you um, opportunities you didn't even realize you had. I've been in it long enough where someone I met a couple years ago who was just at a conference kind of dabbling took a course from Girls in Tech and is now in the career field and they're kind of introducing Girls in Tech to others so it's amazing it's what it it's no longer grassroots this is actually making